guys have you experienced this uh when you attach the iphone 7 or any smartphone onto a gimbal or a holder you experience a little bit of wobbly effect as you can see from the top left side that is because of the optical image stabilizer is uh, shaking even though your gimbal is stabilizing so i'm gonna find a fix for that okay this is a test with the manic this is supposed to make the OIS optical image stabilizer to be way smoother without the OIS jerking around because of the inertia of the shaking uh, even with a gimbal it should be much much stable because of the magnet on the OIS stabilizing it there shouldn't be any wobbly effect right now it should be very very crystal clear and smooth hopefully with the magnet in place it's gonna be way smoother if you do not have any magnet you can actually recycle magnets from all those uh, gadget boxes that have magnetic enclosure this jabra uh, wireless uh, bluetooth spot paste have a cover that has a magnet built in there's like two of them so i just cut them out together with the metal pieces that uh, is non-magnetic okay here i demonstrate how the optical image stabilizer actually vibrates a little bit creating the wobbling effects even though your gimbal or holder is stabilizing your smartphone for ois on the iphone unfortunately cannot be turned off uh, using your settings uh, here i use a manac to demonstrate that the ois can be manipulated by manax so it's possible to actually force it down and uh, you know, uh, does not actually vibrate a, a lot okay here i'm actually showing you that i actually attach a cable which is an electrical cable and onto a magnet and just black tape them together and then a piece of metal that i actually recycled from the jabra wireless uh, spot paste uh, box that metal is not magnetic so when you do not attach the magnet it does not actually affect the ois so you can use it on the hand okay for the gimbal itself uh ziyun smooth q have a little um okay tightening knob to tighten uh, the orientation of the smartphone uh, i use it to tighten a piece of cable this is an electrical cable just a thin one will do you can use uh, fishing lines if you want to but i use the cable which is strong enough i use a double-sided tip to stick the piece of metal which is a very thin metal which i spray paint black so that it does not look very obvious when you are using your uh, smartphone so i use that to stick onto uh, the iPhone 7 on the top right side so that it does not look that bad now uh, it, it just looks very very nice it actually fits uh, when I put my casing on it, it still fits uh, very very nicely uh, again certain angle you still can see it but if you are watching a, a video or using Facebook you will not see it because of the brightness is there so as you can see using the gimbal and the, the manac attached it will not shake them uh, much when you are using the gimbal you can use this strategy for the car holder for your smartphone uh, use the same kind of ideas to attach a magnet but remember to adjust accordingly so that you will not have some edges of the screen that look uh, very blur that way you have the clearest possible uh, you know, framing experience using a gimbal yeah and uh, when you are not using the magnet you can actually uh, put a piece of metal on behind the gimbal so that you attach uh, when you are not using it so that the, the, the magnet will not be flying around when you are uh, filming if you are not using the magnet i'll give credit to all the youtubers all the discussion on the apple forums uh, on the on, online that actually solve this problem using a manac uh, by putting the manac behind the camera this idea is not new so i'll give credit to them uh, however some of the ideas of putting the manac behind is actually semi-permanent for them which uh, some even put a credit card edge with a manac 
stick permanently on the credit card put on through the iPhone 7 casing which is a slightly uh, not very flexible that's why I, I uh, proposed this idea of putting a metal onto the iPhone 7 and then you can adjust the magnet as and when you need it to make the the, the, the screen uh, more clearer when, when it's clear then you start using it without any vibration well basically that's it for this video I hope this really helps you in your filming thank you very much and have a nice day see ya bye bye